principles of engineering unit 2.1.7 trust theory quiz review first thing you should have is a red utensil and a calculator to make sure your calculator is in degrees mode hit the mode button make sure you're in degrees and then to quickly check you do sine of 30 degrees and that is 0.5 so you know you're in degrees mode what we're going to do is review trust problem right here. We're going to review this trust problem here. So what you can do first is angle A is 51.34 degrees. Angle D is 39.8 degrees. And then First thing you have to do is do external forces. We know that A's, or D is the pin. So pin, we're going to guess DY up. Definition of a pin, DX to the right. And BY, B is a roller in this case. BY goes up, BY. So what we do is we use this information to calculate the three external forces. So I kind of have another document here. Help us out with our external force calculations. External forces. Here are your equations. External forces. There's three answers to this problem. First thing you do is take moments about point D. I might need my draw tool. Insert. It's moments about point D. Clockwise moment equals, or counterclockwise moment equals clockwise moment. So when you go back to the picture, we take moments about this point here. BY creates a clockwise moment at a distance of 12. And this 3000 moment creates a counterclockwise moment around D at a distance of 20. So here, just plug it in, 3,000 times 20 equals BY times 12. Single variable algebra, 60,000 equals BY times 12, divide both sides by 12. BY reaction equals 5,000 LB. Here's the calculator work for this. So um, first thing you do is 3,000 times 20. Divide both sides by 12, 5,000. Now, we do uh, Y forces. Up arrows equal down. The up arrows are BY plus DY equals what's going down? 3,000. We use this BY number here, 5,000 plus DY equals 3,000. Subtract 5,000 from both sides. DY equals negative 2,000 LB. So remember, in our original picture, we guessed DY was up. It is actually acting down at 2,000, or negative 2,000 up. So we have two out of the three answers. X forces, left equals right. What's happening to the left? Zero, there are zero arrows happening to the left, but dx is right. So dx just simply equals zero here. There is no horizontal load force in this problem. So three answers complete. Let's see what happens here.
The next thing you have to do is solve for the internal member forces. Remember, for this truss, there are five answers. A, B, A, C, B, C, B, D, and C, D. There are five segments in this single truss. A, B, A, C, B, C, B, D, C, D. So there are five internal forces. We're on this document. Okay. Internal member forces. First joint we should look at is actually joint D. I'm just going to overwrite it here. Joint D. Oop, pen. Joint D, where the pin is. So, here's your pin. Previous answer, dy is negative 2,000 or 2,000 down. And then CD is up and to the left and BD is to the right. Remember, you always draw your tension. You always assume the member's intention. Draw it away from the pin. So we don't know what B, D is, and we don't know what C, D is. And this angle in here is 39.8 degrees. So you might need to create a vector table for this. There's three vectors here. Try and do it small over here. You have a vector. You have an X component and a Y component. First vector. Is the down vector. DY. The X component is zero. The Y component is negative 2,000. Second vector. BD to the left. The X component is negative BD, because it goes to the left. The Y component is zero, because it's perfectly to the left. CD goes up and to the left. The X component would be negative CD cosine 39.8. The Y component is positive CD sine 39.8. Remember, remember, all this sums up to zero. Sum equals zero. Sum equals zero. Because this is statics. So since sum equals zero, let's look at the y column first. Negative 2,000. I guess I could use a different color. Negative 2,000 plus CD sine 39.8 equals zero. Single variable algebra, add 2,000 to both sides. CD, sine 39.8 equals positive 2,000. Divide both sides by sine 39.8. Times 1, CD equals, go to your calculator over here, 2,000 divided by sine 39.8 equals 3124.5. 3, oop. 3124.5. 4.5 LB. Since it's positive, that would be tensioned. That is one of the five answers.
So now we know what CD is here. We could solve for the X column. I'll just use this whole box here. Negative BD. I'll use red for the X column. I'll use green for the Y column. Red. Negative BD. Minus CD cosine 39.8 equals zero. I am going to first sub in 3124.5 for CD. Negative BD minus 3124.5 cosine 39.8 equals zero. I'm going to add this term to both sides, or I'm going to add BD to both sides. It's a single variable algebra. So I get over here BD equals negative 3124.5 cosine 39.8. So BD equals, you should get a negative answer, negative 3124.5. Cosine, 39.8. Negative 2400. LB. Or you could write it BD equals 2400 LB compression. That member is getting compressed. So right now, you have two out of these five answers. You have member CD, and you have member BD for what we need to find. BD and CD. BD and CD. Now, I might need to open up a new document, and uh, let's look at Joy B. So here we go. Insert. Draw. Now we're going to look at joint B. Okay, we're going to cross out this stuff here, this stuff here. Let's look at joint B by itself. Joint B. So free body diagram of joint B. The roller's pushing it up BY. By correct. Always draw your member forces away to start. So let's uh, guess CB is away. And the trick here is we know BD is in compression. So since it's compression, you draw it towards BD is compression which equals 2,400. BY I think was 5,000 up. And then from B we have member AB. And since you know this is towards the pin or towards joint B, you could draw this one towards. A, B. So the two unknowns here are C, B, and A, B. Those are unknown. So let's just play the tug of war game. Left equals right. B, D is going to the left. It's going towards joint B equals to the right. A, B. So A, B, internal member force is 2,400. And it's also in compression because it's towards the pin. So you put a C here. That is one way to write AB. Up equals down. We have zero down arrow, so zero equals CB plus 5,000. CB equals negative 5,000. Or you could say CB is actually experiencing 5,000 
pounds in compression. 